my room is so dark because it doesn't have windows. We're gonna need to set up the studio lights. time I do my hair in a bun I think I can pull it off but I look like a mushroom that doesn't really matter today we're gonna be cleaning and organizing we are doing my makeup I made a video last year yeah last summer when I got this desk I keep my makeup inside of my desk I have a bunch of drawers it's kind of like the Alex 9 drawer set but it's the Alex 5 drawer set so it's just a little less cool I also had these two giant bins I was tired of it in there but that is why in today's video we're gonna be going through this whole thing putting everything away and we're gonna go through all of my makeup stuff because I'm a little bit of a makeup hoarder. I started hoarding makeup and the packaging of old makeup and makeup that I don't even use. We're gonna get rid of that today and we're gonna start fresh. Also, before we get into this video, I just wanna remind you guys to follow me on my social media. My Twitter and my Instagram are both at Kiara Madison. I'm trying to get 10K on Instagram and we're real close. When we hit 10K on Instagram, I'm gonna do a video all about how I edit and post and pose and take and everything, the whole thing of the Instagram. Let's go. So we're gonna start out by giving you a little tour just so you guys can see what we're working with We're gonna go through all that and put it away all of like my everyday makeup is in here So that needs to go away as well and this is kind of oh god I'm like a little bit nervous this stuff is a mess. I think like half of these things are empty I just like I keep the boxes for everything. I don't know kind of weird. Honestly, we gotta fix it <sighs> This is gonna be the really hard thing for me to part with things like trash that I know needs to go. So we're gonna get rid of all the trash, things that are empty, like that's empty. This is a really nice expensive concealer that's just empty. So this is also empty. Do you guys see that there's like yellow stuff? I don't know if it's rust or whatever. It's sketching me out. So we're gonna throw it away. My attitude about e.l.f. is like, it's not that great and I'm not 12 anymore. So I feel like we can part with it. And if for some reason or not, I need another one, I'll just go buy another one. This one's really sad because it's the first piece of Mac. It's my first Mac item. We've officially hit pan. Yeah, I don't really want to part with this baby yet. This is one of those purchases that I watched a lot of YouTube videos and everyone was like, ooh, the Milani blushes, you have to get them. Like, no, this is straight glitter on your face. The next plan of action is to get rid of all the boxes that I have. The product just can come out. It doesn't need to stay in the box. We're gonna be bold. We're gonna push boundaries and we're gonna throw out all the boxes. <laughs> I have literally world's biggest chapstick collection all in the back here. Some of you guys don't know, but I actually went on Accutane a couple years ago and I hoarded lip balm like no other. Oh my God. Do you guys remember baby lips? And these were so cool. I hope I never wore that. Mascaras, all of my uh, pencil-y stuff. And I know I have a million old mascaras because I just bought a new mascara because I didn't have any mascara. So we're just gonna purred completely dried out. This is like my first mascara because I wasn't really allowed to wear mascara. So I wore clear mascara trip down memory lane. Great lash, great stuff. I'm also gonna choose to make the executive decision and say goodbye to all of our little friends right here. I actually heard they're not even good for your lips and I really only was gonna keep them because they look kinda cute. Dun, 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 dun. All right, we're gonna move on to the next drawer. I'm gonna try to go a little faster. That drawer was the hardest for me to do, so I'm really proud of us. Next drawer is a lot of face stuff, and some of this stuff right off the bat, I can tell, can just go. This is terrible, so is that. Let's get rid of the box again. We know better than that now. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna actually take a picture of it because I really liked this. You don't really use these colors anymore. I don't know what in the world I would ever do with a matte pigment color powder. Not a beauty guru. I also have two of the box blushes from Benefit. These are really awesome but they low-key take up some space ah, I made it fit okay we're gonna time lapse I'm just feeling like getting on the grind we're gonna do some Khalid radio really into it let's go You are, you are, you 
Okay guys, we have officially finished the entire cleaning organizing process. This whole thing is completely empty. All of this stuff I'm getting rid of. I have a whole entire bag of trash right there. We were highly successful. I'm really proud of us. Let's get in and do the little tour and show you guys what we got. All right, we're opening up the first drawer. I showed you guys mostly what this looked like and I just added a couple more things in here. It looks really nice, really organized. In the next drawer, we have all of our face products. So these are all foundations and then we have primers, a Mario Badescu spray. These are all like my beauty blender things and beauty blender cleaners. And then my favorite Becca palette is right there. And here, this is like mostly all my lips and stuff and then all of my palettes for eyeshadow. Here's all of my lipsticks that are bigger and then I have like small lip gloss things. I have lipsticks right there and then I have all of my eyeshadows and things right there. And then these are all eyeshadow palettes, blush stuff in the back and some more palettes. In this final drawer, we have a bunch of samples over on this side. They're all organized so these are perfume samples. These are like other face samples and things like that. I have all my makeup wipes right there. I have my face wash and lotion right there, sunscreen, and then all my brushes are right there. I know I'm gonna get a bunch of questions of people asking me where I got all these little dividers. And I actually got super lucky and I got all of these at the Dollar Tree. So I'm pretty sure every single thing is from the Dollar Tree except for this drawer. I think this is from, I'm pretty sure this is from Ikea. Some of it is kitchen-y organization, like this one I know is. This one's also from Ikea, but everything else is from the Dollar Tree. Okay, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you're following me on my social medias. Well, I hope this like inspired you guys to get organized. Comment down below what your next project you're going to tackle is. I think my next project is going to be my room. Yeah, that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Leave me a comment. I always reply back to you guys and I'll talk to you later. Bye. I just dabbed. That was, oh God, that was cringy.